Hello everybody, welcome to Z's Game Corner, my name is Aurelius, and we're going to be doing some more <laughs> Dissidia today, um, try a new journey, EX mission, uh, just one thing first, uh, when it comes to artifact skills, for Lulu, try to get this, uh, Dog Carrion Black Mage, it's just 5% to max brave and attack while Dollmaster is active. You know, and she has some pretty extensive moves, and you know, the more I'm using her in Jack, it's the oh my gosh, those two together are just absolutely insane. As you can see, I'm gonna bring Sephiroth along. Um, his artifact skills not so good. Um, Jack over here. I did have a six star mighty Jack Slash, but I kind of want this buff boost and get his max brave up, you know, even higher than it can already go up to, which is about 27k with the boost and he gets a break. So, yeah, that'll give like a 15% boost to all of that. But I hope you all are having an awesome awesome day uh i'm kind of <laughs> not i think i'm getting sick hence the nasaliness of my voice right now um let's just keep your fingers crossed hope that's not the case and uh, whatever is afflicting me right now uh passes without causing too much trouble you know um so yeah, let's go ahead and try this EX mission. Um, that final resolve, like, oh my gosh, it gives him so much brave, it's ridiculous. So let's go ahead and finger mob, or finger that plan. I'm just gonna hit the attack here. Try to save his moves for these EX bosses. Go ahead and give everybody fire. Was he weak to that? Yeah, with fire Moomba, um, if the enemy is weak to fire, then um, it will give her uh, three levels to her uh, doll carrion mage. Boost. You know, or her, yeah, what's that boost? Right there, the level, that level up. So, yeah, and at plus, it becomes a group attack. And like I was saying yesterday when I was recording, didn't quite have her right where she is at right now. You know, uh, it's Fire Moomba Plus that counts as a group attack. So always, always think of mods, uh, especially if you're fighting a boss. You know, use that first, then do the Fire Moomba. You know, which is Fire Moomba is. Definitely her stronger attack. Um, I'm just gonna go ahead and refresh and refresh that that uh buff that it gives. Uh oh, I heard EX. I heard EX. But we're not gonna go ahead and use it. I'll just refresh him again. This is 38k damage. Like Jack is definitely joins the ranks of the powerhouses and Lulu over here doesn't do too bad herself <laughs> you know that I've been hitting over 30k constantly with her in the co-op and everything so you know um, she's worth building up 
you know, I mean, he hit harder than than uh, some of these characters that have been out for some time. I'm gonna wait until I pop the summon before I use that. Uh, when Sephiroth comes up, I'll go ahead and swap him out with my support Sephiroth. The support Sephiroth is <laughs> not getting a single turn in this at all. And let's just hope we can kill this thing or, you know, get him very, very close to dead before um, the summon wears off. I'm just, ah, 54k. That is so beautiful. Go ahead, Fire Boomba, give uh, that Sephiroth, our support Sephiroth, a big fat um, damage boost with the fire attack. I kind of had no option there. Alright, so Aqua Flash here. I did not do as much damage to this thing as I wanted to. Uh, let's go ahead and check the flash. But yeah, I hope you guys are all happy. Awesome. awesome day. Uh, yeah, uh, let me know down there how your artifacts are going. Like, I just spent an hour and a half. You know, trying to farm some artifacts for Jack and Lulu, you know, um, I do want six star buff boost for Jack and the doll carrying black mage, six star for Lulu, and it just hasn't happened, like, I'm getting everything but those two skills, weird, and then on top of that, I just keep on getting a whole bunch of Waka artifacts. Not that I don't love Waka. Waka is pretty awesome, but in the terms of this game, he's kind of not. You know what I'm saying? So, like, and I don't have him built up to boot. So, yeah, I, I don't know what's going on with all of that stuff. Uh, it is driving me insane to say the least. Uh, like every time I do a run and spin that 60 SP, you know, up there in that stage, is to get, end up with walk up five star I do just like really, really not what I want right now. Like my first run, it was just. Like, I'd get like two, three walkers in a row. This dude is getting three turns in a row. Oh, that's not good. Ooh. This is gonna hurt. Good thing that was the support stuff for off. Ooh. I was totally not paying attention <laughs> to what was going on. Oh, that kind of hurt. That kind of hurt a lot. Uh, let's go ahead and Meteor Shadow. Nice. That's kind of why you do need Waka in this, uh, stage. Because of his dark attack, I'm pretty sure if you go look in the details of this boss, you know, um, probably have a very low resistance to blind. I'm going to be fresh out here. You know, and it, it's just to save your butt from getting hit by that. This is what I wanted. I wanted that break. And with the final resolve, when Jack has that final resolve active, especially after he uses his um, EX move, he gets this consecutive turn thing whenever he initiates the break. So it's kind of like a uh, lightning how you can get like multiple turns in a row without upping the turn count. Then Jack has that now too on top of all of his insaneness power. Uh yeah, I didn't get the HP. <laughs> Definitely didn't get the HP. You know, and I do have a friend that has walk of support. So let's go try this one more time. Let's see if we can't get that Waka support, uh, just for that dark attack. You know, there we go. 
nothing. I wouldn't mind um, getting Waka 35 CP. You know, I, I know with Sid Flash Jackson coming out very, very soon. <laughs> you know, um, kind of didn't want to max them out, but I did in the hope of getting a 35 CP and finally. Finally get him MLD, but it just doesn't seem to be the case right now. You know, I only got two of his 15 GPs. I think, like, in the past, I've only gotten, uh, like, one of his 15 GPs. I've never had a 35 GP. And I've tried to pull his walk before, and I just haven't had very much luck with all of that. Ooh, I know the more my plus. Uh, I think HP attack might be attack too. No, this does major brace damage. So I'm just gonna HP attack these guys again. Save as many skills as possible for the boss. Which is, you know, kind of like the ultimate goal. No, you don't want to burn out too quickly. I'm gonna stick with my beat rushes <laughs> for now. You know, um, ooh, I don't think I use a, a Jack Flash. I might as well do that, get his max save up. Ooh, and he's at 15k Brave Gas, so. Ugh! You're not at 15k Brave no more! <laughs> Just look at that. Nine, 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 on both attacks, like, I haven't seen anybody's Jack get hit this hard. I think I might have the hardest hitting Jack in the game. And, I'm not bragging, I'm just saying, like, a lot of people are rocking Jack right now, and none of them are reaching that amount of Brave, and none of them are hitting enemies as hard as mine does. So, um... Uh, uh, let's just HP attack. Like I said, I'm just trying to say skills. I'm trying to say skills. Make the attack extra so easy. No, I'm not worried about losing his final resolve attack because as soon as Jack comes up, I'm gonna pop his uh, uh, meteor shot. You know, that gives him final resolve for six turns instead of just the one that the beat rush and Jack has. So, uh, how are you guys doing with the uh, pool and everything? Have you gotten everything for Lulu? Have you gotten Jack the X? What about Sephiroth? Or do you not even care about these three characters? Um, or I should say four with Waka. Uh, go ahead and refresh him one more time. And then we'll just start Jack splashing him to death. I'm gonna wait until his little bar fills up before I pull in the summon. That way I can just guarantee that um, Waka will get that blind and we'll have a high chance of of him missing that particular attack. Go ahead and fire. Mm, mm, mm. But yeah, I just, you know, like, Tim, outside of Titus's constant whining, you know, it was a really good game. All the characters in there are, I like I said, outside of Titus' whining, are all lovable. So, Tim was also, like, kind of like, it didn't leave, have this kind of same impact that Seven did, but again, it's new generation of games, new systems and everything. Uh, yeah, it kind of uh, was a little first for a lot of people who are into the Final Fantasy series now. You know, and, and you know, it's just another iconic game in the series. Alright, so next time Sephiroth comes up, we'll go 
cut and swap them out. You know, and Penny did have a good story, good everything, you know, the combat and everything was just like kind of broken the new age of Final Fantasy, you know, uh, especially with 12 and 13 with the way they did things where everybody can just learn everything. Oh my gosh, my poor Sephiroth is not going to be able to get ahead. <laughs> Lulu and Jack are just too fast. You know, they did, yeah, the team kind of sets the standard for the, you know, all the games that we've seen up to pretty much 15 right now. You know, um, go ahead and do another meteor shot. I don't want that sitting on me while I'm waiting to pop this summon. Ah! I, I really don't want to swap her out. But it doesn't look like I have a choice. I need to dark attack him. Oh, go ahead and do that. Ah. Oh, was it something I wanted to do? It really wasn't. We'll go ahead and fire it low. You know, uh, lost his dark attack. There, he's flying through two cards. And let's kill him with the jack flash! Kill him, Jack. Kill him. Kill him. Kill him. Like, all my hopes are riding on Jack right now. Go ahead and just use a beat rush right there. Ooh, he got the pop up. I didn't realize it was it was a knockback kid. Otherwise, I would have just flashed that. that was so aqua flash. He still has fire enchant on him. Um, then we'll do another great daring. Oh, he is so close, man! Yeah! Uh, this run went a lot better, even though I had to swap out Lulu. Wasn't trying to swap out Lulu. Sephiroth is just too slow. <laughs> That's something I never thought I'd say, but Sephi is slow. Oh, sorry, all you uh, Sephiroth fans out there. Like, I. You, 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 just two rounds recorded proving that it. And it takes a while to build up his strength, too. Kinda. Uh, which is why I'm not putting up Lulu for support. I do have my Jack up for support right now. Um, ooh, that's about to say. Not an infinite loading screen. You know, but I don't have Lulu up for support. Just because, you know, she's one of those characters that takes a while to... To, uh build up to did you see you need a score of 300,000 I know when they <laughs> released this event um, it was 3 million again kind of similar with the previous event where it was 270k you know you, the, the thing needed 2 million 700k points ah. so I don't know there's something in their systems when they're putting in these values that uh, are making them jump up into the millions. <laughs> so, but we got a whole ton of draw tickets, like 30 plus, I do believe. Yes, oh no, that put us up over 40. Oh. Oh. I'm kind of tempted to save them for Freya just because I know I'm not going to have gems. And I think I've said it multiple times throughout this series that 9 was my favorite out of that trilogy. You know, and I do want to get Freya built up when she does come. And we still got these guys coming too, as well as Sid and, and Freya. You know, I, it's, just, yeah, it's rough right now. Really, really rough. You know, I mean, we still, we got pff, one lost chapter and two new characters so far this month. And we got two more new characters and another lost chapter comes out this month. Like, it's just a horrible, horrible month.
for your gym count. You know, and I already said I was going to go all out for Lulu, which I did. I did. I'm kind of disappointed she didn't have her EX, but I'm so happy Jack got his. Like I said, I used just one of those characters I destroyed. You know, when I was in a heavy search for Power Stones during one of those uh, heretic quests going on. And yeah, I've been dying. Just tell myself almost every single day I play this. I need Jack's 35 CP. I miss him. <laughs> I miss him. I got something better. I got a ZX. So, uh, we'll go ahead and do 11 draws here on Sephiroth. Unless we get a ZX. If we get a ZX, I'll be happy because I did get his 35 CP maxed out as you all saw. But, uh, Sephiroth EX, Sephiroth EX, should probably be doing this over there in Kane and Bond. I think that's still up, because I can definitely use their EXs as well. But Kane, I just kind of need everything for him. Or no, for Kane, I just need his 35 CP. I forgot, I got his 15 CP maxed out. You know, in preparation for this current... Uh... Perfectum quest. Uh, I don't think I'm gonna. Ooh, another Vincent 35 CP. I will take that. <laughs> and uh, I just finally get him MLB. I really don't care for Vincent, especially in this game. I feel like he just wastes a bunch of turns. You know, and he doesn't really have the damage to do anything about it, you know what I'm saying, like his damage output versus how fast he he gets his turn is ridiculous, like I remember the last event he was part of, you know, he'd run up, I don't know, a good four or five turns, you know, and only did about 40k damage within those amount of turns, and you know, when he got characters that are out now you know uh that's kind of a wasteful thing to do uh anyway i'm gonna go ahead and wrap up this video oh i meant to show you guys that i didn't get this completed last night i sorry it wasn't recording it was really really late and it was just tired and didn't want to do it. I think I did it with Jack Renoa and Lila Set. It's the party that I used and as you can see those are my scores right there. No HP damage, 37 turns and no KO. So not too shabby. Uh, the score was 437 and now you need a 360. Okay, so yeah, uh, if you got those three characters ML bead, you know, Jack Lilliset and Renoa, which my Renoa is not MLB. I still need to max out her 15 CP. <laughs> but I just don't have the Power Stones to do that. Power Stones are just, ah, so hard to come by. And, you know, um, I guess I could show you guys sometime, you know, my, uh, my weapon store. I can probably sell a bunch of uh, 15 CP weapons, but I've just been holding on four characters that, you know, I know I haven't maxed them out yet, and it, you know, I don't want to do that, you know, but this is going to go ahead and wrap it up for this video. I hope you all did enjoy. If you did, go ahead and hit that like button. Uh, to stay up to date with content going up on the channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Um, I think I'm going to start doing something new this week, and I'm just going to hit you guys with, you know, new stuff every week. Uh, I know you see that little playlist down there somewhere <laughs> that says new stuff, and the only thing on there is Fairy Survivor, but there are some things that came across my purview, you know, this past week while I was on my little hiatus, you know, it is just like shocked, it's like how are all these games, you know, getting by me, 
I'm constantly checking the Google Play Store, you know, and some of these were just released so right before Fourth of July when I really wasn't looking because I was focused on having fun. You know, the barbecue, the spending time with family and everything. You know, and fireworks. Of course, you cannot forget the fireworks. So yeah, I expect some uh, videos going up a couple of times a week. We'll try to add like two new things to new stuff and we'll set up something to where like, you know, I want you guys' input. If you want to see that series continue, or that game continue on the channel, go ahead and let me know in the comments. But that'll be for the new stuff section. You know, um, you can also follow me on Discord, Facebook, Twitter. Ooh, excuse me. Twitter and Twitch. You know, details for all of those will be down there in the description. Um, yeah, my Facebook page changed again. Like I said, I'm still learning how to use all these resources that I have at my disposal. You know, um, and uh, just found out I could make my own page. I thought it was like some kind of user email. No, it's actually for the page name. So I went ahead and got that changed and make it a whole lot easier to find on Facebook. You know, my uh, my page over there. So you guys go ahead, check that out. And like I said, I'm constantly uploading stuff to Facebook and my Discord. You know, and I usually tweet out what I'm going going live, you know, as well as posting it on Facebook and Discord. So follow me on those. Uh, you know, um, join the community, get more involved, you know, because you guys know anything about this. <laughs> Feel free to leave comments down there and give me suggestions and everything and what I should do and what the next moves are. You know, because uh, like I said, I want to grow this I really, really do. This is something that I, I like doing, and you know, I've always been an entertainer at heart. And no, I haven't really gone anywhere with this. You know, I thought I'd be some big shot actor or music star or something like that by now. And you no, know, so this is my way to entertain the people. So this is something that you know, my whole life I wanted to do. This is how I'm going to reach you. You know, so I'm not going <laughs> to stop doing this anytime soon. So you just might as well join the bandwagon. You know, and let's ride this thing until the wheels fall off. <laughs> I hope you all have an awesome, awesome day, and I will see you all later.